Hi, I'm Julie Alvin with Auto Week TV. We're here at the SEMA show in Las Vegas, Nevada. It's day two. We're here in the Central Hall and the charming Greg Migliori and handsome Mark Vaughn are gonna give you guys an overview of the show. Go ahead, guys. Thanks, Julie. We're here high atop the SEMA show at the Mother's Waxes, Polishes, and Cleaners booth. Thanks very much to them. And we are uh, overwhelmed with product here at SEMA. What did we see? There was some stuff from Lexus. Stuff from Lexus, very cool. There was the uh, GS, wide body, great white glacial color. Really impressive looking car. I liked it. The Lexus GSF made its debut here. We haven't driven it, but we did see it. It's a yeah. nice car. Dale Earnhardt Jr. customized, designed 1970 Chevelle with GM Performance and Chevy Performance just here for the show at SEMA. Why did they do this? It's to debut a new series of crate engines. Tell us about that, Mark. A couple of crate engines, uh, the LS3, uh, LS7. Yes, yes, very they powerful V8s. They now come attached to a transmission, which is really handy, because that way you don't get a really nice engine and then blow up your transmission. You're going to blow up probably the differential or something, but not the transmission. It's a really handy thing. And they have a new program. If you're really dedicated, you can go back to the factory. And where is it, Wixom? Wixom, Michigan, performance build right near where they make Corvette engines. And you can build it yourself. Now, they're not just going to turn you loose on the... Uh, line to build your own, you know, misbuild it. They're going to have a guy with you go all the way down the line as you build your own engine, just like they do at AMG or someplace like that. Well, just like AMG. And what's cool about this is they take these crate engines and then they put them in like a restored, very cool hot rod. This year it was a Chevelle. Last year they did it in like a 55, 56 Bel Air. Beautiful cars. And it really shows off the technology. Really exciting. But uh, going forward to the future a little bit, we got the Veloster. Just arrived on the market. Big car for Hyundai. Big deal car for Hyundai. They had several of them. Reese Millen tuned one up. Lots of interesting cars. Lots of cool colors. They even are going to turbocharge it uh, starting next year. And Monday night at the uh, Hyundai dinner, I was sitting next to John Krafczak, CEO of Hyundai Motor America, and he announced that the 1.6 liter turbo Veloster will be coming. This is a very authentic show. We liked it. More than 2,000 exhibitors, tens of thousands of people here at SEMA. Very impressive show again, as usual. It's 2011. It was a good SEMA. So far, we're only halfway through it. None of us have slept. We are delirious. Are you? I'm totally delirious. And with that, back to you, Julie. Thanks, guys. That's it for today. We'll be reporting from Detroit tomorrow. Until then, enjoy the drive.